from small presents like socks to jobs. So we try to do as much as we can for them. This family is helping new Canadians experience Christmas and the magic of the holidays as they take on the hardships of settling in a new country. But what Nicholas and his family get to witness by helping low-income families celebrating their first Christmas in Canada is why they've been sourcing and donating gifts, groceries and resources for the last 18 years. Happiness, uh, relief, joy, tears of joy, um, just Gratitude. They could be landing immigrants, but they could also be a refugees. Um, and typically they don't have too much. Uh, so what we're trying to do is give them a little bit of relief. Nicholas and his family moved here when he was four years old, coming from Colombia not long before December. Their first Christmas was going to be humble as they settled in a new country. But some generous people helped make it special. They opened their trunk and it was bags and bags full of toys and presents and things for the house, things for my parents. And so it was a really meaningful Christmas. Uh, and so we decided that when we were a little more stable, we wanted to pay it forward. So now Nicholas, Natalie and Valerie, along with Carlos and Alexandra, all work to do the same for families like this one. Even Toby and Bolt get involved. It's actually fun going to other people's houses and seeing and giving them presents because it feels like we're Santa <laughs> or we're like they're elves. Thank you. Thank you. Now the recipient families are also paying it forward. We've started creating the snowball effect where families that we've helped in the past are now helping families now. From one family to now 20 this year. The goal is to spread joy for Christmas, but also beyond that, as these people make their new homes in Canada. We want them to succeed, right? So we, we're just trying to give them the little push they need to feel like they're not alone here. If you'd like to donate to First Christmas in Canada, visit their Facebook page, seen below. In Calgary, Taylor Broad, City News.